Is music, I'm not big enough drums. <laughs> is music the language of the soul? That's what we want to know. <laughs> I think, yes, of course, it is. Because what else can be understood by everybody? And that's the thing with music, you don't even need to understand the words, do you? I mean, I actually quite like it. When you don't understand the words, you know, like if it's in another language, sometimes I prefer that because you're just listening to the sound rather than the actual words. And sometimes that's quite nice. Although obviously some words are very powerful. So it's also um, quite important sometimes to understand the words. But yeah, I like both. <laughs> um, so yeah, music I think is um, very important. Much more important than maybe people realize. Um, Music is therapy for me, and I think for a lot of people. And I don't think there's any civilizations or tribes or people living anywhere on the planet that don't have some kind of music, you know, that they make some kind of instruments or just get some sticks or something, you know, just do some kind of rhythm. There's always, like, singing and chanting and, you know, in every kind of society and culture, whatever it is, music is usually a key component because I think it, it's what keeps the spirit kind of alive, the spirit and the soul. It is language and music of the soul. I don't know what you call it. <laughs> food for the soul. That's what I'm trying to say. It's food for the soul, I think, music, isn't it? So, um, I'm not very good with these terms. Um, say, back in the days of the slaves, um, one of the things that got them through it was music you know they would sing and the, the songs were passed down from generation to generation and they created this kind of amazing sound and i think they also made instruments when they could you know um and that became really the birth of the blues you know if it wasn't for, for that music that came from the slaves there wouldn't have been the birth of the blues and the blues was also the beginning the beginning of rock and roll so we wouldn't have a lot of the music we have today if it wasn't for the slaves, really, <laughs> you know, so it's like that whole thing, everything happens for a reason, you know, and sometimes good things can come from bad things. So obviously, <laughs> not saying it was a good thing that it happened, really, but it, you know, there were some, some benefits and that was the silver lining was the, the amazing music. And it's just, it just shows the power of music that that got them through it, you know, it, it was that that got them through, um, been treated so badly because it kept their spirit and their soul going otherwise they probably would have just given up wouldn't they so it's this amazing power that can come from music and also can bring people together so it can really unite people music I think you know and um, people can have completely different opinions on everything but then if they all love a song and they all sing along to that song together it brings this union it can really help people I think to to yeah, feel oneness and I've been to many concerts where I've really felt this kind of amazing oneness um, Michael Jackson probably for me was the main one and a few others but just these huge outside concerts I find the best because there's something about being outside in, in the elements as well um, as long as it's not raining even if it is raining yeah it's still good but yeah I mean I've been to some, like even at the O2 Arena as well, like uh, Leonard Cohen I saw there, and that was magical too. And he just had this amazing presence, you know. And I think he definitely had something very spiritual about him. And when he performed, he brought that, you know, and it was like, it was like a religious experience. That's the only way I can explain it. And I think that's what music is for a lot of people. It is, it's like this connection to God almost. It's maybe the, the power within us, you know, within the, the divine, you know. Um, and certainly it connects us to, to our soul in a, a powerful way. So, yeah, I think music has a very important part to play um, in the new earth and already does in this earth anyway. So, you know. Yeah, music is key. And, um, yeah, hopefully um, that will be one of the things that really can connect people.
and it already does. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah.